the book questa is our Aaron the book questa to introduce you to this almighty book fantastic beasts and where to find them by J.K. Rowling the author of Harry Potter itself it's the original screenplay this the screenplay part means it's also a movie and this is like the script and yeah it's pretty fast does this story starts with Newt Scamander a wizard this book takes place before Harry Potter before Harry Potter ever went to Hogwarts or indeed Voldemort himself this was when Grindelwald was the main threat this was when you know many many things was happening fantastic beasts and where to find them one day Newt Scamander a wizard a magic magic zoologist he with a lot of magic creatures entered New York all his magic creatures like the Thunderbird or the Erebent Okami they're all inside his briefcase a magical briefcase you could go inside the briefcase and there will be an enchanted habitat for the fantastic beasts that inhabit them and and on Newt on the way bumps into a man named Jacob Kowalski. He is completely innocent, mind you. And she doesn't know anything. You know. And then he crashed into each other and their switch their 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 cases got switched. And Newt and Jacob opened the case. Many, many creatures inside the case came out, out, out of the briefcase and, and spread along New York. Some of these creatures are the Niffler, Another beast and another beast. Fantastic beasts, as you can call them. And Newt and Tina are a fire Eurora. A Eurora is a kind of magic police tries to get back all the, and the animals before they are in mortal danger from the wizards who are trying to stop from, from the wizards from being exposed from the humans knowing that the wizards exist. And it's quite very, very serious. And there's the looming threat of Grindelwald, the, the dark wizard who wants to see himself and wizards rising upon muggles or non-magi those they are called not wizards and and a hero named Graves happened to be Grindelwald himself and he what he wanted was credence a normal boy is because Credence was not a normal boy at all. He was an obsequious. He was a kind of a monster, a beast, fueled by hatred and anger. And Newt tries to help Credence, but at the end, Credence is seemingly destroyed by a, a group of heroes but you will see that he is actually not. that is that today I saw the movie of the second book the crimes of Grindelwald it is a screenplay too 
so it is exactly the same as the book. So I might as well say it. Grindelwald. Grindelwald escaped from the custody of the Ars, and he is gathering followers to stand up. Meanwhile, Dumbledore sends Newt Scamander to capture Grindelwald, and Grindelwald will be fought. Yes, but with what cost? Meanwhile, Prince is still alive, and he wants to know who is he, his exact identity. And in that second book continues on and on, and at the last part, the alchemist Nicholas Flamel, a, a group of Urs, including Tina, Newt, and Newt's brother, battles against Grindelwald, but Grindelwald escapes, and he lives a deathly fire spell, but they manage to defeat him. And there, the both are really good books slash movies. All of the descriptions are the same. Now, what to be not confused of is that there are two fantastic beasts and where to find them. But this, this fantastic beast is a pastry. A pastry is a dictionary of monsters and fantastic beasts. So this is a dictionary, dictionary of monsters, and it says by Newt Scamander. You see, Newt in this in the story, Newt is trying to write a book about fantastic beasts and where to find them. And this is the exact book that Newt Scamander wrote. So that's a fantasy, and it's actually by J.K. Rowling. Rowling, but well, in the fantasy world, it's by Newt Scamander. That's not to be confused. This is the story, the story, the trials and error of how Newt Scamander wrote this book. This is the artifact, the exact completion of Newt Scamander's book. And they're both really great books. And like always, your bookwester, Erin the bookwester. Gotta go, my friends. Bye bye.